It's been a devastating and heartbreaking week for this community. Friday night was a chance for people to come together around a common love for the game of football. Wearing the number 55, the brother of Nick and Gavin Ouellette leads the Bow High School Falcons onto the field on homecoming night. At 6.55 p.m., a 55-second moment of silence to honor their teammate. Nick's number was all over the field, on helmets and on shirts, as a town pays tribute to Nick and his younger brother Gavin, a first grader. They were killed in a car crash last week. Their father, a school resource officer, is recovering from his injuries. This community has really stepped up and come out and supported this family, and it's been a whirlwind week but it's gonna take a while. In confronting the loss, the superintendent says they tried to make Friday a normal celebration of all sports and extracurricular activities. It was really a focus on homecoming and focus on the kids. We had a, a whole SAU wide, wear your sports shirt, you know, support your teams, support your town, come together as kids. The football team has dedicated its season to the Willette family as classmates continue to carry their memory in their hearts. So we don't want to forget, we don't want to move by too quickly, but at the same time, part of healing is getting back into routine and, and, and doing school and moving forward. Nick and Gavin Ouellette will be remembered at a memorial service on Saturday. A celebration of life starts at 12 noon at SNHU Arena in Manchester. In Bow, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.